There are signs the housing market is finally slowing a bit in West Michigan, but are prices cooling off any? News Ace Emily Leonard talked to an expert and is here with new numbers. Emily? Well, Brian and Sue, last summer homes were selling so fast, realtors often didn't even bother putting those for sale signs out. One of the big changes between last summer and this summer is the rising interest rates, which is making the leap into home ownership that much harder. This was the last recession. Paul Isley has kept an eye on all aspects of the West Michigan economy for years. When it comes to the housing market, he says the rise in interest rates isn't the only factor that's starting to slow the market. When you add in the increase in the price of the houses compared to last year, you're now talking a $600 a month increase compared to what somebody would have paid last summer. The most recent sales numbers show nearly 900 homes sold in Kent County in June. That's down 9% from a year ago. But even as sales level off, prices are still rising, up 9% to an average of 358000 Isley says other parts of the country are seeing their housing market cool off faster than West Michigan. He believes that's because we have a large number of millennials, particularly in Kent County, who are in the market for their first home. And because we have such a large proportion of our population that is in that age range, it's going to help support our prices for longer here in Kent County than what we see in other parts of the country. When it comes to larger and more expensive homes, Isley says people in the market for those homes are not seeing their wages keep up with inflation, so they're faced with making some decisions. You're starting to see people maybe buy one size down or one type down. So there's starting to be a little bit more weakness there. So here in Kent County, there's still a lot of strength on both sides. It's just getting weaker on the top than it is on the bottom. Isley says the last year has been shocking for those watching or participating in the market because we're just not used to seeing prices rise as fast as they have. Where we are now is we're going to have a higher price environment going forward. Isley said although the wages of people in the top half of the market are not keeping up with inflation, they have a lot of equity in their homes to put back into the market if they're looking to upgrade.